Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. It is Tyler Tarver with Tarver Academy, and today we're going to talk about spreadsheet vocabulary. All right, so we're going to go into our test sheet that I created in Google Sheets. Um, if you need any more help with Google Sheets, make sure you click on the other videos in the YouTube channel. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but I'm going to continue to do it. So here are about 10 key words for Google Sheets, and I want to go through each of them. Okay, so first off, we're going to talk about a row. Um, just like in math, when you talk about rows, this is your horizontal, these are horizontal cells. So this would be right here, that's a row. That's row six, that's row 10, that's row 16. So that's a row. So if I click this, I could be, I can fill the color green. That's a row. Okay, columns, that is going to be your vertical options. So see all these? So your, your rows are in numbers, your columns are in letters. So this right here is, I'm going to move this over here. This is a column. I'm going to make that yellow. So that's a column. Now, a cell. A cell is each individual rectangle. You guys see this? The blue, that is outlining a cell. So this itself, by itself, is a cell. Okay. Now. The sheet, that is the entire doc, okay? So we're looking at this entire spreadsheet. Um, so that's highlighting the whole sheet, but the sheet is everything. So it's, it's I'm gonna put equals the whole page, okay? Next, we got the formula bar. Um, do you see up here where it says fx, which in math was a function of x? So you've got your formula bar up here. So what I can do is I could do like equal sign, sorry, equal sign. Um, and then I could put, you know, a cell and add them together. So like a two plus, you know, a three. Now I could do that, but it's saying error because I don't have numbers in there. So if I did like, uh, Let's say I put four here and seven here, and then I'm gonna change that to B3, which will be this one. So let's say B3 and then B, what is that, B4? Before, boom. So now it's gonna add those two together. So my formula bar allows me to make, do different math problems. Um, using these spreadsheets okay so there you go so cell range range in math just means like um, you're talking about like from B to you know it would be this cell down to this cell I'm selecting a range of where they are so it's like B2 all the way to B14 that's the range of cells of which I want to include so uh, there's that wrap text okay this is a good one a lot of people don't know this so um, if I said hey What's up? How are you? This is a long sentence. Now, if you'll notice, that goes over this. When you want to talk about wrapping text, what that means is it's going to wrap it within that cell. So let me actually put it in the cell um, related to what we're talking about. There we go. See that? Oh my goodness, that's terrible and ugly. So I'm going to select the cell that I want to wrap, and then I'm going to go up here. You see this little guy? Right now, it'll go over the line. Here, it'll wrap the text, and here, it will just clip it. So it would just like cut it off. See, you can't read the rest of it. But if I do wrap, it's gonna expand the cell so that I can read everything in it, okay? Merge cells, um, I can do, um, like I say, I wanna take all these five cells right here. I wanna merge them to where it's just one cell. Um, I can go up here to this. Click this button and boom. Now this is one long cell. See, I can highlight it. Oh, oop, I just deleted that. I can highlight it. This color. Let's make it red. That's one cell. Whereas all these are individual cells. Formula. Um, your formulas. That's what we talked about earlier. See this being a math problem. So I could take, um, let's say I did six, uh, three, let's add them. 54. I don't know why I did both of those, but here we are. Um, I can select all of these, and then I can, oh, it's hidden up here. 
uh, but it's this right here. This is your, these are functions. It's where you can put formulas in. I can do like a sum. It's gonna automatically create it. Bam. It's gonna add those up because that's what I picked was sum, which means add. And the last one on our list of vocabulary terms is sort. So I could take, um, let's delete this because that's gonna be ugly if I don't. So let's do um, three, eight, and 55. So I can go up here to this column and you see a little drop down arrow? I can click that and now I can sort um, either from you know A to Z or Z to A. So with numbers, it's gonna sort um, like A would be zero, one, two, three, all the way up. Z would be your largest number going down. So let's do that, boom, largest number going down. I can do the same thing here with just you know alphabetically, boom, it's gonna put them alphabetical. Just know that when you do that, you're gonna, it's gonna usually, the default is for it to knock and change all this stuff as well. So it changes, it takes the whole row and sorts it based on whatever you choose. So there you go, guys. Those are some basic um, terms, vocabulary terms you'll need to know for Google Sheets. Hope you learned something today. And as always, never stop learning. Later. Hey, what's up? Thank you so much for watching my training video. If that helped at all, please subscribe to this channel. It's free, costs nothing. Just click the little red subscribe button unless they change the color. Hey, also, if you want me to come to your school and help train your teachers or your administrators or your students and help make your life easier with Google, just let me know. I've got links in the bio on how to get a hold of me. DM me at Tyler Tarver on Instagram or Twitter. You can go hit my email, tylertarver at gmail.com. Um, or you can just yell really loud. Maybe I'm close. Oh, I thought I heard somebody. You want me to come training on Google? No? Okay. It'll be fun. We'll learn a lot. And I'll give you a bunch of resources. So, thank you guys. Hey, did you subscribe? We talked about it earlier. No pressure. But if you want to, I'll be here. I'm just going to wait right here. Look at this lighting. Oh, wow.